Hello everyone, this is Jom from Civil Center. Welcome to our channel. As we know, Civil Center is continuously working with the vision to guide civil engineering students and professionals. And for that, we keep making videos on different software. So what are we going to learn today? Today, we will learn how to make a balcony in SketchUp. So for that, I am just creating a three feet wide balcony over here. So I am using my push pull tool and I will enter the digit three feet. Okay. So let's do it three feet. Now, it's about the rectangular balcony, but what if you want to give it a better look? then you can use your arcs from here. So I will just draw a diagonal over here. And for that, I am choosing the line tool and I am drawing a diagonal. Then I can go to the arcs and I will choose a two point arc. So I will grab the center and make it like this. Now, Let's also draw a rectangle over here. So I will just erase this. Then I will go for the rectangle one. From here, I will draw a rectangle approximately in the two third portion. Then choose a line over here. Then I can go for the arcs. And I will draw an arc over here. Similarly, I will draw another arc on this side with a similar radius. Now, I will draw one more arc on this side. Now, I can use my push-pull tool and just pull it downward to the edges. Now, I will just erase the unnecessary lines. But before that, I need to draw a line over here so that the whole section doesn't get deleted. Now, I can use my eraser tool and erase the unnecessary lines that are available over here. Now, I will just erase a few more lines and modify this slab. Okay, now I can select the lines from here. Use the control button to, to select the multiple lines and then using the move tool, I can make a copy of it to the bottom. Now, I will just select this line and also make a copy of it over here. Now, I will draw a line from here to here and from here to here. So all I'm trying to do is to get a face over here. So I've got a face over this place. Okay. So this trick is not working. So I can go for the another one. I can select the edge and use my push pull tool and I can push it to here. So this way you can get a balcony or better you draw a line from here to here. And that way you will select just this portion and then using push pull tool you can pull it to the desired height 
and you can also make a copy of it. Now, let's fill this portion by joining the line over here. Okay, so you have got a slab at this place. Now, you don't need this line. Now, you want to make a handrail over here. So what you need to do, you need to select the edges first. And after the selection of the edges, you can draw or drag it to a height of three feet, three inches. So using your move tool, you can make a copy of this at three feet, three inches. I will repeat the process. Now, let's select this completely. And then, use a circle, mark it as the midpoint and draw a circle of radius one inch. So, now you can use your follow me tool and click on the surface of the circle. So you can see you have got a handrail over here. Now to get a better view, what you can do? You can just draw the pillars for it. So I will just reverse the face edge over here. Now we can use a glass panel over here. For that, we will just pull the surface to this place and this height. And then we can just apply the materials on it. So for that, we can go for the glasses and mirrors. And over here, we will choose the glass that we want. And we can simply apply these materials over here. So you can see our glass material has been applied to the surface. And then you can easily get a balcony with glass over here. Similarly, if you want to go for the handles, then you can choose for the metal one. And for that, you will have to go to metal. There, yeah, choose the metal that you want. Like I'm going for this one and apply the material to this. So guys, this way you can make a balcony with modern design in a sketchup and if you want to join our live online classes then you can find a link in the description which will redirect you to this google form all you have to do is to just fill this google form and i will personally give you a call so that was all for today see you in the next video